Hello everyone, today I'm going to show a quick demo of using Emotive Epoch headband. Um, this is the device. Currently I have wear it on my head. I just got a haircut yesterday so that this signal is better. <laughs> no, that's joking. So it has uh, 14 channels of EEG signals, it has 2 channels of gyro uh, signal. I think the uh, data frequency is like 140 hertz. Uh, so now I'm going to show how this signal looks like. Uh, it's using a wireless connector and this is like the uh, wireless uh, receiver to get the signal from the um, from the from uh, this device. So let's look at this uh, screen and then I will show. So currently this uh, these are the 14 channels, this is real-time 14 channels of my uh, brain. Um, I will try to keep calm and then I will uh, like blink my eyes for example. I'm blinking my eyes and these are the signals that is caused by me blinking my eyes. Uh, it's just to show a quick example. You can also uh, capture some of the facial expressions. For example, now I will do uh, a, a blink. And then I will do uh, a left smirk. Mm. A right smirk. Mm. 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 Um, Try to do a throw my eyebrows. Yes. Blink. So yeah, it can recognize some of the facial expressions, and you can also um, it can also do some kind of um, uh, mental commands. I've already pre-trained my brain signal. I've already trained four actions: push, lift, rotate clockwise, and disappear. So um, currently, I will um, show each uh, example, show each action. First, let's try the uh, push. So I will uh, close my eyes, uh, close my eyes so that it, uh, it gets into a kind of a neutral position. And then I will sync push, and then let's see if this thing uh, moves. Now it's neutral, and now push. Nope. Mm. Push. Yeah, so that's the push uh, command. As you can see, uh, it gets some of the force lifting commands uh, because it's not 100% accurate. Uh, and now I'm going to try the disappear command. See, it uh, the object disappears. Now let's try the um, uh, lift. Okay, and that's the lifting command. And lastly, I will try the rotate clockwise. You can look at me. Okay, so now I'm going to think about uh, rotating it clockwise. Haven't got it. Let's try again. Yes. Yeah. So, so as you can see, uh, it can get some of the commands most of the time. It seems that it's working, um, but it's not hundred percent accurate. And I so I pre-recorded some of my brain signal to train those commands. And I believe that as more and more data was collected and trained for me, it's going to work better. And another thing that is worth noting is that uh, the signals that it was trained based on my brand probably won't work for some others' uh, brand. We can we can try, it, but that's my uh, guessing. So that's it. Uh, thank you.